But I tell you what, that well water helps out. Mm -hmm. If it wouldn't be for that, that's, I pity the people with city water. Oh, watch your head. Yes, sir. See, the cucumbers are doing, doing good. The mm -hmm. tomatoes are... You see how, last time I came, you see how small they were? Wow. I put a little, that 2020. Yes, sir. And uh, then we got that grass when they cut. And mm -hmm. I just, for some reason, I never did do good with that covering for the bell peppers, but I do good with the grass. And the grass don't grow and it stays moist. So do you let the grass turn brown before you put it on there or you put it I on there green? I put it on there just like that and I wet it. Mm -hmm. And it just sets and it, the worms cut me two of them. Mm. These four right here, they're looking good. That's some new ones. That gave Kermit the seed, mm -hmm. and it's called a sweet bell. Mm. The other ones are better bells. Is the bell variety? I planted a declaration bell, revolution bell that we had, and seeds are hard to get. But these done better. Mm. But these, the first time I planted, but they look good. Yes, sir. But the worms cut me too. They suck them at the bottom. They just, and then the bird, you can see the birds caught me one. They clipped the top. Uh oh. So I just left it. But you can go. I mean, it's uh, the tomatoes are. And look, they're not hard. Yes, sir. And they got flowers in there, and, and uh, so far it looked good. We, I think we're gonna make a crop. Yeah. With now, your peppers, do you ever pinch the tops or no? You don't have to do anything. Okay. With with these that don't, they don't vine. Uh, you don't have to do anything. You just let them grow. With your peppers, I mean. Huh? How you said the bird pinched the top off of it. Yeah, I have it, some friends that they it, actually pull the tops off their peppers to make it bush. You just let them grow tall? I, I just let them. They usually grow and they'll grow out. Yes, they sir. They got some that do that in the summer. Mm. After they make, they cut it, and then they grow out for the fall. Gotcha. I never did try that because I make enough. I got enough. And yes, so sir. So what I'm going to do when this is, is finished, I'm going to do it and i'm gonna plant a couple of cucumber plants here and the other ones i'm gonna plant some purple hull beans mm. all alone I'm, I'm just gonna leave the peppers yes sir but uh but tomatoes are doing well they are they look I, great I, I don't have to do anything i don't have to hold them i don't, I don't. it was supposed to rain this weekend so, so friday i mixed a little 20 the 2020 right and i just kind of put it on and the rain sunday net got them down boy and they uh they're looking and good, you huh? You see, when, when you tie them on that, on, on that wire like that, we had a lot of wind in them. That, that don't disturb them. Yes, sir. It just, and then that's my extra two plants that I got. Mm -hmm. But, I mean, uh, so far, I haven't lost anything. Yes, sir. Uh, my neighbor lost two. Mm -hmm. You can see the empty spot. It, yes, sir. They just started just drying up. Just like whatever that aluminum does i can't explain it but it works but it works huh it, and you can see look at the colors when you get tomatoes that are blue green like that and don't they're healthy yes sir so low maintenance i just let them grow and yes sir when they're ripen. but i tell you what that well water helps out mm -hmm. if it wouldn't be for that that's i pity the people with city water i it's know be tough. i'm comparing right now my garden at the gym has city water the one at the property has well water and it's like a night and day difference. Your chlorine, because mm -hmm. the more you put in, the more and the water evaporates. The chlorine's in them into the ground. Plus your lime. Mm -hmm. You keep putting lime, so you're raising up your pH. Mm -hmm. And you don't want to get under six. Uh, I mean, over six. Yes, with sir. Tomatoes and that. Yeah, you I want to keep your pH. I tested my pH and it was definitely high. So I need the to. Same it's thing sulfur like I was telling add. you about when you plant next to a brick house. With a slab, the even the mortar is all cement, and as the water hits it, it leaches out into the ground. So your ground keeps absorbing that lime, and your pH keep right. And as age grows, they, they don't make, they don't do well. Mm. Blueberries, you got, you got to have. That's how I found out. I had planted some blueberries, done good for a year or two, and after that, they just started going down, and I started realizing my pH was too high. Yes, sir. So I, I just quit, but I see the roses that I, I put. Mm -hmm. uh, I put some nitrate, and I'm, I, I use a lot of uh, Miracle Grow. And and then Carmen had got some uh, sulfur from Shostones to uh, lower the pH. So I, I put some in there, and I put some at Brenda's, and they're doing good. Yes, sir. I'm gonna have good, to try that. Know? I've also heard some people say you can take a rain barrel if you have city water. 
put a rain barrel and let your water sit in that rain barrel to let some of that evaporate and yeah. then water with it do you think that would help i don't know I've... the only thing i know when i was in high school in science they brought us to the on off of buchanan street to the, the process the water and it was all lime. That's how they soften it. And nothing but white, you could tell the lime. So that goes out all into the water. Mm -hmm. And the more water you use, especially if it don't rain, right. you just keep adding it, adding it, mm -hmm. and your pH just keeps it don't rising. Take, it doesn't take long. And your roots just absorb it because it's damp and they absorb the full, I would assume. Yes, sir. I, I kept my water well. Yes, sir. So, and you can see uh, so far. But we planted late this year for Easter and it's been hot and dry. But it still looks good. So, when it's coming, the zucchinis are gone. But um, you can see the cucumbers in that. They're doing, that's in point set. I'm going to give you a cup. You'll be able okay. to check them out. Yeah. I've I done real wet them, well with them a few years back. So, I was just changing them back. Because, I mean, uh, you, he, my neighbor plants, uh, we've been planting dasher too. Mm -hmm. It makes a cucumber at every flower. But the seeds are expensive. And I just wanted to plant some a different variety. Yes, sir. In there, because I had done well with it. So, mm -hmm. so far it's looking good. And look, no maintenance. My host still says. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. You know what I mean? That's a good thing. Yeah, and you can see that. Look, they got cucumber hanging. They got them all over in that war, and they all. Mm -hmm. uh, Your peppers do look good. Yeah, I mean, you remember how small they were? They were. Yeah, well, you can walk in there if you want. You they were tea tiny. They got a few of them in there. Though. You sure do, yeah. They look good. Right, right here. You see? Mm-hmm. They, uh, they're doing well. They're well water. They got them in now. Broke what five, six this morning. Mm. But this over here, these are gone. Uh, they don't, they don't do well in the heat. These are planted about a, a week or two later mm -hmm. so they could make a little later and they got some hanging in there but this is the one the bird cut that one mm. yes sir i'm gonna see I, I just left it yeah but they're starting to make uh let's see i had seen some with some uh some little flowers yeah they were getting ready to make the they had the little buttons mm -hmm. that they were uh i had seen one Look at the stalk. Oh, yes, how sir. Good. But they're doing good right here. So, look at the tomatoes in there. I see that. And, and you know, I, I sent you a picture 27 inches on. Yes, sir. The, the year before last, they had them, they were over my head. Wow. Right here on this. Mm -hmm. It's just too much. They just keep making and making it, and the bugs and that. It's just a lot easier to maintain. Mm hmm. You just tie them up and let them make. That is the Bella Rosa variety. Mm -hmm. Very good tasting, and they make pretty much. I mean, look at the flowers. Yes, sir. And, what uh, do you uh, suggest for hornworms? I'll show you what I... Uh, Kermit's been having a lot of problems. You're going to see how this going. He's been picking them up by hand. Mm -hmm. I haven't had hornworms here for a good while. The problem that I had here was them little army worms. Yes, sir. And I'm sure, boy, them little things get in there so small. Mm -hmm. And by the time you notice, they, they've eaten a whole bunch of area. The horn worm, they leave the flower and them things grow big. Yes, sir. He pulled them on. He had a bunch of, for whatever reason, uh, I haven't had much problem with that, but them little army, mm -hmm. they eat a green, a kind of blackish green, and they're small, but they, they'll, before you know it, they'll clean you out. Yes, sir. You know, but I'll show you what we got one. Is the liquid. See the bore these that's the ones I had. Mm, gotcha. the army worm, bag worm they call it, tent caterpillar. I got this at Shawstones. Yes, sir. I don't use that unless I really have to. Mm -hmm. Then you can use uh that's a root this is which one is the nitrate you said you use oh the nitrate mm -hmm. i mean you, you is it calcium nitrate no I, I, this is the nitrate that i got from so i, forget, I don't know what it is mm, i mean I'll you can't use a lot of that it you put that in the ground it's tough so i put a little bit on top of the ground i put me one teaspoon in the uh, water whole mm -hmm. soy tomato 
then I water it in and it, that way it just leaches out. Yes, sir. That stuff will burn quick. Gotcha. Okay, this, this is the, the powder that I use. It'll kill all them horn worms and them uh, other ones. Mm -hmm. It's, uh. I'm gonna have to try that. Di uh, Dipole dust. The, the, uh, they used to have a professor mm -hmm. on Mimosa used to do plants, him and his wife. I mean, that guy was sharp. He, I used to go get all my plants for him. He was a UL professor into that. And he used to, uh, in back of the, uh, oh, that little, uh, store, uh, what, what, uh, it's a little Russian. They used to have a, a farmer's market and, uh, it's off of Foreman Drive and- uh, I know where you're talking about. He used to sell all his vegetables. We used to get blackberries. And he, and he and his wife is the one that got me. And mm. did it. This was maybe 79, 80. Mm -hmm. That's how long, about 40 years ago. And she's the one that told me that. And this is, is like a biological thing. And what I do, I, I, I got this. I put a little bit in here. The old country boy, you know, you got a mm -hmm. cool boy stuff. I got gloves that I do with that. I got an old sock. Yes, sir. Put that in your sock, and you just kind of just let it kind of uh, just, just pat it powder. on everything. Yeah, like a little pot on the leaves. Mm -hmm. When they eat them leaves, they'll roll them. Yes, sir. Again, no doubt. And you're not putting a lot, you know. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna so, have to try that because. But that's. It's a lot. Sawstorm used to sell. Like the five pound, the two pound that. No, they don't. They just set it like in a in a little thing. I mean, it, it, it's it's because so Kermit ordered me that online. Mm. Yes, sir. Him and I can use it. Now, if you have uh, insects eating the leaves, like on beans and that, you don't use that. You use I got my gloves in here. Use what they call viper. Okay. And I do it the same way with a sock. This is. This is. Hmm. This is for insects that eat. You know, sometimes mustard grain, beans, but they they get them green. They fly and mm -hmm. they they eat up all the leaves in that. See my little sock in there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> my little spoon get an old sock and you just kind of we used to do that in the cotton fields and that before they they done away with ddt yes sir and we should we go spray that and, and, and it's expensive you know yes sir so we just we had them old nylon stockings mm -hmm. like that, and uh we'd go out there and, and it would just uh, that powder would just fill or oh, it it'll roll them, yes sir know? So we good. That's Perfect. what I use. 